Welcome back to a new Amnesia custom story. This time, this is a total conversion called Ryuka. Now let's start Ryuka. It's a very peculiar custom story as well. You know, the kinds I like. So I'm really looking forward to that, this custom story. And I also remember to say that um, due to a game breaking bug, in our heartbeat will be discontinued due to me not being able to go back to a certain areas in which I have to find the glass jar which is necessary for continuing but if I want to um, reload <coughs> from an earlier point I cannot go anywhere those those area with those areas that load after you walk through a door um, do not load anymore <coughs> Ryoka says I got are you mistaken sorry about this I just want to explain why I'm not... I chose you to be my champion. There's no mistake. <coughs> Ryuka says, You got the wrong person. I'm paraplegic. I can't walk. I'll help you walk. Now come outside. I'm waiting for you. <laughs> Interesting paintings. I can really see. So yeah, I just wanted to make uh, sure, you know, the message comes across that I can't continue in a heartbeat anymore because of the game breaking bug I just you know <laughs> the point is that if I try to load from an earlier point I just can't continue in certain area doors that are already open if you can remember that I had to go through an open door and then there's a black screen but then it loads another area that just doesn't happen anymore is that a note? oh I thought there was a note so, I think Ryuka is a Japanese girl. My books, I read everything here twice. I don't want you to see my underwear. <laughs> Why not? I want to see underwear. Bansu. Right, um. Oh, uh, yeah, just without further ado, let's go. Yeah, interesting house. My parents are sleeping. A little bit too colorful for my taste. <laughs> Another thing is that you know, internet is just so terrible here. England overall has terrible internet. If you don't believe me, ask PewDiePie. He always complained about the internet as well. <laughs> so England, you know, I don't understand why England has such terrible uh, internet. Fix it, England. Come on, it's not so difficult. So yeah, it's nothing I need in there. So my internet is really bad lately. Sorry about that. So I might not be able to do as much amnesia as I used to, depending on you know. Because I would like to, of course, keep uploading daily. But sometimes if it takes like seven, eight hours to upload something, yeah, that's a little bit too much for me. There's an orb there. Bissa plane has the same problem as well, so that's why he isn't being so uh, active in Amnesia lately. Picked up eyes of oh eye of Horus. I am too weak to continue. There I go. I'm really happy I found this cousin story because it seemed to be a really good cousin story. What is this, anyways? It's a lantern. Huh? It seems to be full. Like not a demo, demo, and a bunny. Horus, hear me, human. The sphere that you hold is my representation. I communicate through it. The humans found it, and I destroyed their flying transport. Now you must protect the humans and your world from it. All right then. What? Why? What's going to happen if they find it? They will unleash my powers with their tests and half of your galaxy destroyed in the blink of an eye. Interesting. Why? Who are they after the... Who are they after the sphere? <laughs> Hundreds of different organizations and we can't waste any more time. You must leave this place and take the eye away. Huh? 
What ho? What about my parents? My home? Their ignorance is this meth on this method will keep them safe. But I'm I'm just a girl, weak and fragile. I can't even walk without help. I'll give you all the health and power a human can handle, and now you're allowed to keep that power if you prove to be war of the E. You'll be the strongest human ever. I ask you to complete my quest in return. Really? Stronger? Okay then, I'll do it. So be it. Go and pack up your human things. We must leave immediately. You puny human. <laughs> Alright then. So it's quite interesting. Leave home. Horace told me to go into my room and pack my things. Holy moly. This is, by the way, in the... I never felt this good in my life. This is, by the way, in the Christmas star. I haven't modded my speed in any way, so... Just so you know. Feel free and so powerful. No, I want to see Ponsu. Uh, huh. More private stuff in here. Oh, I mean this place. Oh, this is the tail thing. Cell phone. Hey, I have a cell phone. Cool. So I want to say apparently you can also make your own map with a map creator that is available for this custom story, uh, total conversion. It's pretty cool, I won't do it myself, but you know, just so you know. Down the rabbit hole. Okay, that's the the book, yeah. It's not the custom story, because there's also a custom story called Down the Rabbit Hole. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, I guess that'll be it. Back, back. Any claws? Oh yeah. You go close. So yeah, this is a really a very unique and interesting Christmas story. I am pretty amazed that I missed this in my... This was released in 2013, so it's, it's peculiar that I missed this because I was non-stop playing EGM, so is there something else I need to pick up? It's just... that's it. Oh, I can't light that one. That. Yeah, I guess that will be it. Adios, mom and dad. Am I now capable of going? Oh, cool. It's my health, I guess. <laughs> but it says my health. Right. I have to just... I'm ready to go now. Good. Just in time. No name of place, anywhere far and hidden, but fast. Uh, the Esmeralda city. It's a famous sunken city. <laughs> Seriously, yeah. You think of a... Uh, I can see it, it's perfect. Perfect case. You think of a city that's underwater. What about oxygen, you know? you probably drown. Relo, what? A what? Nani? Yeah. So the continuous problem I have with the internet is that the default gateway is not available and then I have to completely reboot, reboot my IP address. And even then, it sometimes... Uh, this is amazing. This is the main library of the oh, Esmeralda city. Oh. It sank slowly into the ocean more than 300 years ago. They'll never find me here. This place is mine now. Mm ha ha ha. And soon. Time for my quest now. I gotta find and steal every artifact they took away from me. Bring me here any book you suspect it holds one of my items and I'll take you there. Oh, I see. That's interesting. Once we gather them all, I'll revive to fight my enemies once again. Mm. 
Then I get to keep my health and powers. Correct. Wee. A horse quest. Um. I gotta show any book to horror so he can tell about me that then I must search for and steal any artifact I might find there. So what I wanted to say about my IP address is that I have to constantly reboot my IP address and it's so annoying. But it sometimes works, I get internet for a, a couple of days and then it refers back to the same problem and then I have to do it again and then it's annoying. <laughs> Credits. Uh, Amnesia Matryuka by Am. Um, um. I want to give special credits and thanks to Rapture for the library pillar center of London on Ryoka's cell phone and news. Okay. Nakitno, Nakitno and Kiandra and McBits the static. Okay. It's, uh, I'm sure it's good that they made it and tutorial. Okay. Let's do a tutorial. Do you want to? How do you? Okay, I like that. All right. That's really interesting. This is a series of tests to show how you use your ability to step into the portal for relocation. Oh, that portal. Oh, God. This is a really interesting Christmas story. Wow. <laughs> I'm really excited about it. So, of course, first the tutorial. Because, you know, I want to do every aspect of this Christmas story. Huh? Ryuka's uh, agility allows her to walk up the walls. Use it. Run to the wall and jump. It won't auto track if you are touching the wall. Okay. What do you mean? I was running. So what's the... Huh? Almost. Again. But uh, I guess I have to do it from here. Come on. Why don't you work? Why do you want me to do it like that? Oh. A little bit like um, Prince of Persia style. Yeah. So it's good to do the tutorial. Or else I would have been stuck somewhere else on, <laughs> on this. Come on. Just can't, just can't reach it. And here they don't want to. Okay, it's just <sighs> why? Why don't you want to work? Uh, come on, God, I was there. What do you want me to do, mate? Come on, that should be somewhere. I was capable of doing it earlier, come on. Why is this so hard? Come on! How, did, how the fuck did he get over it then? Jesus Christ, come on. I was almost there, but it doesn't want to go over the edge. Oh, there we are. Man. Hmm. <laughs> Alright then. It's a bit of a hassle, but eventually you get the hang of it. Climbing. Rika may use objects bodies to boost herself up. Usage. Jump. Point above the box or surface and press use when the hand icon appears. Oh, this one. Oh, ah. Uh, 
think, uh, yeah, Umbank, Umbakarna also had them, this kind of stuff in his custom story that you can jump and then to like death. Yeah, like that. I think Umbakarna had also it in Destiny Rebellion and Revenant. Okay, that, that I know this uh, skill, so. Can I also do it via there? No, I think I have to. Little. It's kind of Prince of Persia style, the uh, wall walking. This is a really good game, to be honest. Ah, I played only Sense of Time, but I really enjoyed it. <laughs> Stop! I didn't ask you to do that. Okay, so what do you want me to do here now then? Oh, I have to fall through here? No, I, I doubt it. Alright, so I have no clue what to do now. Do I have to touch that? I mean... <laughs> what the hell? Oh! Okay, so something happened. Oh, I see that happened. Will I die when I jump like this? Oh, I won't. It's cool. Cool. There's a book here. Finger snap. Ryoka may set things on fire by snapping her fingers. Usage. Point directly at the object. Ryoka will set it on fire if possible. Ah, I see. Eh? Not too fast. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Yeah, stop. Ow. Oh, almost ow. Yeah, okay, I get a hang of this. That's cool. Okay, I also have to go to those places, I suppose. Okay, so you don't need to hold uh, to pre uh, spam spacebar. You can just do it without spamming spacebar. Oh, what the hell happened? Sorry about that. I finally figured out what to do. So the only thing you had to do is not... You didn't need to jump on onto the platforms. You just had to point it from a very far distance. Like that, and then if you wanted to get that, you just have to point towards it with your cursor from this angle. You didn't need to go up there, so that was my mistake. Okay, so I opened it. Uh, oh, I see. <laughs> Climber. Ryoka may also claim any wall she can grip onto. Usage. Point at the wall deformation. Click the letter icon when it appears. Yes. Fair enough. Gonna go fast, boy. Oh boy. Um. To be fair, <laughs> I am now unsure of where to go. What the hell is that there? What the hell is that? Do you do, do you think I need to go in here? Down there, I mean. Ugh. Okay, down we go. What's this? That's just a lamp. Okay, lamp post. All right, I guess I just go here. All right, so I guess I just have to double jump like first like this, Ugh, and then like that. <clears throat> I know the tutorial might be a little bit uh, lame, but I have to do it in order to get through this custom story. <sighs> what the hell is that there? I swear to God, what the hell? Ow! Fuck! 
Energy Gazer. Rearcon use Energy Gazers to perform powerful jumps. Step into the Gazer to get thrown. Alright, yeah. Fuck. Whee! The hell? <laughs> Broke ass boy. Fuck. It does follow me. It. Ooh. Phantom traps. Phantoms will set traps to kill you and eat your flesh. Detection. Anything out of the place is a potential trap. Activate the trap and move away. Need that. Trap. Huh. So did I do good? Yeah, he's gone. <laughs> no! Wow. Ow. Oh, no, I thought I got that. <laughs> Glide. Rika may call upon the aura sphere to defy gravity. Use a splash lantern to. Uh, okay, so lantern button to gain any anti gravity boost up. Charges. Four charges. Auto cooldown in four seconds. Use with combined with other jumps. Can be used to prevent high falls. Alright, so... Like that. Okay, I get hang of it. So, is it a real lantern? I mean, can you use it to light up stuff? So, okay, that was the tutorial, but I... I think I'll continue one episode one other book optional book unavailable the optional books might be the ones you can create I'm not sure I'm not sure why they are unavailable in the first place see you can just look at them and then they will lit up you don't need any tinder boxes anymore like it's the most used it was the most useless thing anyway. I had thought further ado. What is this book? Okay, it's tutorial. We don't need a tutorial anymore. Unavailable. Let's see why it is unavailable. This book is under development. Huh? So yeah, you can create your own books with your own levels. Unavailable. There's so many unavailable. Unavailable. Oh. Unavailable. Well, which ones are unavailable? <laughs> Let me guess none. <laughs> and you're just like, well, this was the tutorial demo. Uh. What the fuck? I'm gonna go. I'm stuck with water pressure. Boom. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> oh boy. So I guess those are the books um, you can make by yourself. Alright. Alright then, I am back again and I finally found one book that was capable of being used because uh, I did find another one which is an optional book, The 10 Challenges and I found a whole lot of like these ones are quest books but unavailable so I think those ones will become available once you have uh, done like uh, this once you completed one quest book another quest book will become available i think it's something like that so let's do this one we are going to need her powers for our mission step into the portal for relocation 
Yeah, I will. So, uh, for a moment I thought there were no books available because there were so many unavailable, 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 and I was like, really? Well, luckily I found one. And probably the other quest books will become available eventually. And even perhaps the optional books will become available. We'll see. Let's hope they do. So, this custom story won't become a disappointment with just one or two quests. <laughs> wow, interesting. So I come here to steal artifacts, eh? I see a place which... Oh, remotely. Uh, by then. Very interesting. Uh, let's, uh... Can I have an um? I do not think I can make that jump from that there. So I need to find artifacts, huh? Eh? Uh, no, I don't think... Oh yeah, lantern. Alright, so I have to keep in mind that I can use that lantern though. Okay, I can't go there, okay. Wait, perhaps I can just... Jump and... All right. What the way? Yeah. So, uh, do this place go? Rocks are levitating, but hmm. I might need to go up there, though. And I might be able to go up here. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, cool. Um What the hell is that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it don't fuck this please. Ah, almost. You know what, perhaps it's... I have to go... There. Yeah, I think that would be the wisest. You see... Ooh, something happened. Oh, I don't think this is a, play, a very jolly place to be. Uh, doesn't sound very... Jolly in here. Abandoned horrors are pay. Says who? Who? Right. Okay, so I need to find the lever for here. And yes, object is missing here. Yeah. No clue what kind of object it is, but we'll find out eventually, I guess. Oh, I could just do that. What the hell is that? An object is missing there as well. Um. Nope. Oh. So I need in total one, two, three objects. Okay. I'm not sure what they're supposed to go in there. But I guess I'll find out eventually. Uh, I wish I could have some... Some... Uh, progression in this episode. I'll try something one more time, something else. Oh shit, there it is. Key, Mystic Artifact. Perhaps the key goes into the hall, but at least I need something else. Sure. <laughs> Alright, so I found a cave, which was, if you can remember this place, it was here, where I found the stones that I could pick up. 
En voilà, daar is een kip. Zo, so, at least. I have, I guess, some progression. I hope. So, what does this cave has to offer us? Oh, hello there. Um, okay, so there's definitely something going on. Just uh, figure a way out to get up there. Ooh, <laughs> that's over it. It's not what I wanted. Stop. Come on. I'm running. Almost. So you have the dude there. <laughs> Broke as boy. Um, don't hurt me, please. What are you doing, by the way? You're not attacking me. That's good. I don't want to be. I don't like to be attacked. Oh, finally! Let's just start. Mystic artifact. Ow! It was a leg. What do you expect me to do, right? Okay, I found another mystic artifact. Ow! Not nice. <laughs> It was a chest, yeah, I know. I, you know, how do I know? How did I know that the chest was wrong? That the chest was a trap. I mean, a chest isn't something out of the ordinary. I mean, I would think that the chest is not something out of the or out of the ordinary. Oh boy, I was so badly to be be done with this puzzle. I guess I have to also find the third artifact so in this map. Why are you doing this to me? Stop! I bet you ass that there's also... Th Alright, one more. One more. So, um... See you in a bit. Alright, I found the last piece of the puzzle. I knew there had to be something up there. But then again, you have to be quite perceptive in order to see that you could do that. So, it's down here. And I'm back here in this place again. <laughs> You want the leg? Whee! Uh, burn forever with me. No, I'm not going to burn forever. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Cause this is the last artifact. Hallelujah. So you have to be really perceptive in this story. Oh boy. Oh wee. I do like this uh, mechanics of uh, gliding. It's fun. Finally. Oh. Let's not be too enthusiastic. <laughs> no. Come on. Right, finally. Oh. Open. Sesame. Street. Ooh, fuck. <laughs> what the hell? Finally. Oh, Jesus Christ. I thought they would never escape that place. I wonder if you would have real-time enemies here that will hunt and kill you. But we will find that out in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed it, even though it was more like an introduction puzzle episode. It was uh, sometimes a little bit annoying to, you know, 
get it going because you know it was quite you know the jumps were sometimes quite difficult to master and the puzzles were so very difficult so um i'll see you in the next episode cheers